What's up guys, we're back with another episode of Alan Wake Remastered, this time with my brother. I'm not here. So before we continue, I'm just gonna do a quick recap of what happened. Um, but for the most part, it's pretty simple. It's about this journalist who hasn't wrote in in over two years. He's at this vacation place trying to rest, Titties. relax, but he keeps on having this scary dream. Uh, if you guys haven't seen the last part, go watch that. And um, we're gonna hop right into it for, so this is episode stuff. We're on episode two. It's like the cabin or something, so let's continue the game. We're also not gonna be talking while the game audio is playing, so like when it's playing like guys, the sound effects. Guys, did Malachi effect. shit his pants last time? Didn't it? Here, I need to say that closer. Did Malachi shit his pants last time? No. Nope. Please switch. No. The, okay, the gamer switch. always plays. Did something all right. Oops. Don't worry. Oh. I'll get I'll you get inside safe and sound, sound before, before it gets dark. dark. And I've got the flashlight. Mm -hmm. So. Does he have a kid? Alice no, it's just. Phobia. The fear of darkness. I wanted to make sure we were inside with the lights on before sunset. So he did. She's, she's scared of the dark. So he did have a kid. No. I'm trying Alice. to remember how the fuck to play. No, that's your wife. I'm trying to remember how to play, guys. <clears throat> Alright, I remember. How do you slap somebody? I remember how to play the game. I've never played. I know how to play the game. I don't know what you're talking about. Nice. No, Bam. I know how to play the game. Alright. Well, I'm at the cavern. I can't run. I know how to play Subway Surfers, guys. It's dark in there. Can you figure out how to get the power on, honey? No. Fuck no. Who the hell's that? Hmm. Uh, right over there. Her. You her? Yeah. It's Alice. Why is she outside? She's afraid of the dark. Pussy. They just fucking said oh. that. Anyone here? Ooh, coffee. I, I swear I heard something. Oh, I don't go upstairs. So the creepy shit happens. If any noise comes in the background, it's me trying to move this chair. Well, I can't open the downstairs doors, which means the power has to be up the stairs. Um. If I get jump scared, I'm blaming the guy. The power has to be up here. Can I open this door? The cabin looked like a time capsule from the 60s, or even earlier. Why'd the door shut behind you? It's, uh, it's called, you shut the door? It's called gravity. Um, well, the power's not in here. I don't Give see it. Up. Got a nice painting of a crow. That's a bitch. Eric, stop pulling the chair fucking forward. I can't see. You can see. Hold on, guys. Give me a second. I'm turning down the brightness on my laptop. I'm uploading the first one. Because it still hasn't uploaded for some reason. Knock, knock, bitches. For a moment, the oppressive feel of the nightmare I have seen on the ferry returned. Well, fuck. What? Damn. Wasn't that scary? No, okay, good. Um, I needed to get the power running in the cabin. There had to be a fuse box or a generator somewhere on the island. Caught oh, down the fucking stairs in the basement, got you retarded, Alan. All right, let's go and check outside then. Try to bash the door down there. Oh, the shed. Why didn't you fucking tell me that? You just now saw it? Give me like a ghost in here. I can't open this door. What the fuck, Chappy? Let me in, motherfuckers! You know what? Fuck you guys. Oh, what did that say? Exam. The island had once been the site for a love story. Maybe it would be that again. Oh. No. How the fuck do I get in here? Um. <clears throat> no fucking door. What was that? Let me run through the lease. Focus. Look at the water. 
eyes to the shoe. What am I trying to focus on? My dick. Tap. Alice had told oh. me about Calder Lake Lodge. I told you. The old building used to be a hotel. Oh. But these days, it was no longer open to the public. Oh, I was pushing the other one to switch cameras. Oh, I know it's not the beautiful view. If you're up there, it'll be beautiful. An old generator had been connected to the power cable. Alright, here we go. Let there be light. Let there be dicks. Alright, that should turn it on, right guys? Nope. Should be on. Okay. She's gonna take a shower. A no, I'm not the fuck I'm not. The what fuck you? you uh, what he's like, I'm gonna look around a bit. The fuck? Who the fuck does that? It was a beautiful place. I told myself I could rest here, sleep here, and forget about my work. <gasps> oh, this was part of the um, very beginning. I thought we could be happy here. You guys don't remember that from the first part. I do. He doesn't. No. I'll show him after the video. What the f Why the fuck are you out at night time? Oh wait, yeah, you're not a pussy in the dark. Stupid. Bro, sit here, let me regen. Ha, huh? that's a call back to episode one. For all y'all who know that. Oh, fuck we aren't. Alice? Yo, bitch. Honey? Niggas gone? The shoebox filled with books by Thomas Zane sat on the shelf. I'd, I'd never, never heard of him before. Who the hell's Tom and Zane? Where the fuck's Alice? Oh. Um. The deer has guests have already started to drive. Just ran into one on the ferry. Famous artist, no less. We'll see if we can rope him into an interview later on. Now let's uh, go to the phone call. You're on KBFFM. Hi, Pat. It's Rose. Well, hello, Rose. What's on your mind? I know who that famous artist was. Uh, God damn it. I'm sure he's glad to be here too. Well, folks, I guess the secret's out. This is Pat Main on KDFFM. Now is it? Great. So much for keeping it. Yeah, I mean, weren't you like trying not to? Be? She's gotta be up. I'm up there. I have a girl for you. She's butt ass naked. Oh, she's gonna be a demon. Well, hello there. I mean, I have a surprise. It's in the study. Go take a look. Who the fuck's a study? Okay. Across the hall. That dick. Surprise. <gasps> a typewriter. I guess I have a small confession to make. I thought maybe you could write here that a change of scenery would get you past. Dick, Alice, you. Everyone hey, 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 just, just hear me out. out. There's, There's a local, local doctor, doctor, Dr. Hartman. I read a book of his. He has a private clinic here. He specializes in helping artists. So now you want to get me committed? No, it's not oh, like that. Damn, Alan. Alan? Alan? God. No, just don't. I don't want to hear it. God damn it, Alice. She's about to get murked. God no, she goes missing. I knew she wouldn't follow me in the dark. I needed some time alone to think things through. <gasps> no, dude. This, dude, fuck you, leave your wife? The cabin's gonna go dark, and there's gonna diss a fucking pier. You're gonna turn around, she's gonna be gone as fuck, and you're gonna be like, shit, where is he? The fuck's up with you now? Holy shit, it looks like I was fucking right. Why the fuck do you leave your wife at an old ass cabin you meet in the dark? All the lights were out. I'm on way! Oh, she's inside. He didn't know you. Alice? Back door's gone. That's not a good sign. I think this is a good idea to fucking move. Oh, no. Oh, 
dead body in the water. The fuck you doing, man? Stupid as can be. Actually, yeah, it makes sense. She's scared of the dark, so she would probably want to get out. <gasps> this was from the trailer. This was from the beginning intro, too, guys. Fuck you up, Eric. Fuck off. Yo, we gonna get a drive? I couldn't remember how I got there. All I knew was that something terrible had happened to Alice. The phone was dead. I'd have to find help on foot. That's not good. We're halfway through this episode. It's a thing called a charger. You dumb bitch. Among Alice's things was a book, The Creator's Dilemma, by a Dr. Emil Hartman. Seeing the book brought back my fight with Alice. I didn't like it. And I didn't like the guy's smug face on the cover either. Yeah, go into there. Mm. Jump down there. I'm not gonna jump, I'm gonna die. Just go to the city, that sounds more like a good option. Fucking sprint. The gas station was my best bet. They'd have a phone I could use. It looked like a long hike through the forest to get there. You don't have to go through the fur forest at all. Just follow my route, okay? Um. Not kinda looks like I have to go. Follow my route, I say, the bitch. Huh? Um, the fuck were we drunk driving to? Um, okay. To reach the gas station. Damn. There goes that smart guy's face. Glad we decided to get out of the car. We should probably run there. Get there quicker. Or you should walk. Fucking run, my guy. If someone uh, you sees you running or anything, if someone's coming after you and join the fight, smack. Nah, bro, ass. you sprint your ass. Hello? <gasps> the light. A fucking bright light. Hello? Hello? Someone there? there? Oh, oh no. Not this shit again. Now they're gonna be his pieces of paper of the story. I read the back. The lowest sheets of paper were pages from a manuscript entitled Departure. That was the name I planned to use for the next novel I had never gotten started. I was named the author. I hadn't written it. I couldn't remember writing it. In the scene on the page, the hero was attacked by an axe murderer in the woods at night. You know what that means, right? It's gonna happen. Yeah, you're gonna attack. You're gonna get attacked by an axe murderer. And he's Wait. gonna murk you. Departure by Alan Wake. Is it? The man turned to face me. His face was covered in shadows. It was hard to make him out in the darkness of the forest that surrounded us. But the axe he lifted was plain to see. It glistened with the blood of his victim. He grinned madly. The shadows were alive, distorting his features. It was a scene from a nightmare. But I was awake. I mean, you could be a mar uh, nightmare. Uh, like... Anybody there? Please! I've been, I've been in an accident. accident! That was scary, I'm not gonna lie. I haven't had, like, any jump scares, just, like, shit like that. That's creepy. That's not a jump scare to you? Not really. She didn't come out of nowhere. I reached a checkpoint. Just jump off. The lights up ahead were a good sign. Maybe I wouldn't have to hike all the way down to the gas station to find a phone. No, that's gonna be where he's at. Um, I have a feeling this is how I get in. I have a really weird vision. Yourself and you just the um. That guy's an axe. You know, I was thinking like a battle axe kind of good dude. I know. Anybody here? Please. Please. Help. You go hey. straight to him. I had to. There's been an accident. I need help. Listen, I need to. 
It was impossible to focus on it, as if it stood in a blind spot caused by a brain tumor and eye disease. It was bleeding shadows like ink on the water, like a cloud of blood from a shark bite. I was terrified. I squeezed the flashlight like my life depended on it, willing it to stop coming any closer. Suddenly something gave, and the light seemed to shine brighter. Why are you reading them? To know what's gonna happen? Gun and the flashlight, my guy. Pick up the fl <gasps> This was from the scene too in the very beginning, guys! Yep, I know that too. <laughs> Wait. Yes. Somebody. No, the flare gun is like a grenade. It fucking kills all of them near it. Or you could shoot it up. Signal for help. That's what they're meant to do. I mean, I gotta go this way, right? Mm -hmm. Do that. Do that. Follow that arrow. <laughs> follow the damn arrow. Eric, the arrow just took me around to the back to where that chest was. Oh, I'm stupid. Yeah. Why well, can't be stupid? That's this was right here. Um, have to go that way, right? Yeah. No, I'm not going that way. Um. Ooh, some way. Probably death. I got. I, I mean, it would be reasonable to do this. See if I can. Kick. There we go. 
The dark forest was the last place I wanted to go, but I had no choice. I had to get to the gas station. a bunch. Set started up. That should have been easy as yeah, shit. And let me guess. And then we're gonna push this and then the thing's gonna move down. So now I'm just gonna walk across. Is that a fucking shotgun? Oh fuck yes. I will fuck a mother. Oh, uh oh. Don't, don't read it. Don't read it. Uh oh. Don't we're missing it. Don't read it. We're missing a page, guys. Don't read it. We gotta find another page. Oh, this page. In nightmare difficulty mode. So yeah, just read the next one. Okay, so there's some that I can only find when on super hard. I heard them before I saw them, swooping down from the sky and screeching as they came. I spun around just as the cloud was upon me. For an instant, I stared into a hundred dead eyes, black pearls glittering in the darkness. I raised the flashlight and the swarm exploded like fireworks. 
feathers burned, turned into ash. Like, I couldn't hear those scream about vampire vampires. Mm -hmm. I mean, that makes sense. Vampire bats because they're exploding the light. Is that vampires the only thing that I can pick up? Looks like it. Fuckers don't want to mess with me out of shotgun. So you're not missing any pages? No, because I can only get that on nightmare difficulty. And I don't really want to do that. I'm going to play that shit. I have to. I need that manuscript. Manuscript page? Yeah, that piece of paper. Piece of paper. Part paper. Alright, well, let's just fucking use this. So it. far, there's been no. Oh my god, look it. I was right. Keep going. Keep. Keep it, keep it, keep it going, keep it going. No, dog, it's perfect. That's all I need is a little Stu bit. Did it stop there? I stopped it. Sure. I did. Sure. Guarantee. Get the fuck. Your stop arms smell. smell good. Mine don't. And you took a nasty ass shit. It wasn't a shit. It was a dump. Same thing. <gasps> Two different things. You can jump. Yes, I can fucking jump. What's the jump button? What the fuck do you think? A. No, it's triangle. Yes, it's fucking A. And no, I think it's X. It's X. Squared. I know how to do that probably now. I was just outside for a fresh air and what a night. I know most of you are probably in your beds by now, but if you're still looking around, take a look. Step, Step outside, outside for a spell of weed and deep. Ooh, the wind is absolutely still. Sky is crystal clear. The forest is quietly breathing in the water. The forest is not the water. And the air out is on the ice. Sandy, that's why. We're about to get jumped, I feel. Oh, there's another air. Oh, another chest. Another shotgun. That's a flare gun, some flare gun. Got two flare guns again. Yep, I already got a flare shotgun. Guns. You have four flare guns. Four flare guns? Yeah, you have four flare guns. Not four flare gun ammo. Four flare guns. I don't. I got five flare gun ammo, ten bullets, and six shotgun bullets. You have four flare guns. Yeah, every time Oops, it's my, it's my mom. One up. You picked two. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There you go. Mm -hmm. Call it back. Mm -hmm. I'm recording right now. Here, I'll take the call. Mm -hmm. Manuscript. Mm -hmm. I'll call mom. Is that okay? Wake finds pages. At first, I kept, I kept finding the pages, pages as if by accident. accident. The, the book, book I couldn't I remember was either a terrible or true prophecy. prophecy or an act of creation that had rewritten the world. I began to hunt the pages feverishly, for they held the answer to the mystery. With it, I could save myself. With it, I could save us. Well, stepping step now, my mom called. Maybe you guys are like, well, fucking shitty kid. I'm like, I don't know. I have a job to do. I don't get paid for this. Shit's fun as fuck to record for me. The gas station, station was closer now. Also, it's I'm making an album in the darkness. Fuck this shit, I'm running. Raping me. Sure. Now I'll heal up in the light. My heal? Yeah, I'm good on HP. 
Holy crap, they're like raping me. So I can pick up. So I have to go that way, god damn it. Um, well, I'm gonna end the video here, guys. Safe, what does that say? Safe Haven. Well, I'm gonna save here. I just got a checkpoint, right? We'll play, we'll play until I get to the next checkpoint. But I'm pretty sure this was the next checkpoint. Throw axes now. Great. Isn't that great, guys? Sure is great. Oop, manuscript. TV and gas. Into the gas station garage. It was dark. Yeah. Uh, once I get to the next checkpoint, we're in the end of the video. Uh, yeah. I stepped into the gas station's garage. It was dark and quiet. The place was a mess. It looked like someone trashed the place or that there'd been some kind of fight. Light spilled into the room through an open door at the back, and I made my way toward it. Without any warning, I was blinded by a bright light. An old portable TV on the shelf had come alive by itself. Impossibly, I could see myself on the screen, talking like a madman. I'm out of shotgun bullets. You are? Yeah. Did you kill that guy yet? Killed. I shot a few of them. So he's not dead yet? No, he doesn't die. Safe haven. Checkpoint reached. So this is the end of the video. It is a little bit longer. First one should have came out by now. Sorry for the late upload. The internet at my house is just terrible sometimes. And, um, yeah. So, I'm sorry for the late uploads. If you leave a dislike, I'm going to purple nurple you. Just making shit up. <laughs> um, if you guys do like these scary games and you wanna, <laughs> you want us to start playing more of them, uh, tell us in the comments. <laughs> yeah. if, if, the, if the comment gets enough life or I get enough comments to do something, I'll probably do anything. And if you leave a dislike, I'm gonna purple derp with you. Man is just obsessed with nipples right now. So, I hope you guys like it. Heads up, there's going to be a new album dropping. I know it's very weird for me to yeah, say that yeah, it's going to yeah, be songs yeah. I dropping. I need to take a shit. But, um, we have a few. We got 9-11, My Heart, My Love, um, my The Way dick. the Fate Changes, Gamer Mania, Rap Battle, Malachi vs. Eli, Eli vs. Eric, Eric vs. Malachi, and then a trio rap battle, I think. I don't want to go against Eli. We have a few, and, um... We hope you like them. Like always, I hope you enjoy the video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye